Are we having some technical difficulties? We're having some technical difficulties. Are we waiting for the fucking demo mode. Anyways, welcome to Coed Gaming. Move, man. You're I fucking taking up the whole entire couch, I, you fat cow. I can. So this is a Stephen and Christopher Hopkins ep episode. Hey, what's up, guys? This is the mix sexes. This is the mix. Uh, Homophobes. Homophobes. <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. So, what do we find? Uh, you wanna do completely new? Uh, we're playing Spyro. You're the dragon. Yeah, this uh, is the third one. Yeah, the third one. This is probably a lot of your childhoods. Just, I know it was mine. And we're gonna butcher it. We're gonna butcher the shit out of it immediately. An evil plot folds. No sleeping. Oh, oh, look at all the eggs. <laughs> How? Now, 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 here's the thing that I never get. Why are there so many eggs if there are no females? How's it going? Good, sir. Um, there are no females. Maybe, maybe they're like plants and they have sex through breathing. Stop, don't breathe, you'll get me pregnant. <laughs> Photosynthesis? <laughs> Photosynthesis. I never understood how, like, they're dragons and they don't hear them. How? Dragons are assholes in this world. <laughs> <laughs> they kind of just see. The, <laughs> they're just old and crotchety. All nobody, the time. not even the cat hears them. So <laughs> that sound made up. Oh yeah, but they hear that. Yeah, they hear that. And it, it wasn't even a convincing scream. Look at his back though. That's that's my fucking computer. No, it doesn't matter. Hunter was never that good of a character anyway. <laughs> he had good character development. Since when? Since oh, part yeah. two, when he hated you, and then he decided hated to love you. That's his only character development. <laughs> Managed to capture the eggs, uh, your highness. Every last did she just say Sir Highness? No, Your Highness. Oh. Maybe but you know what? I wouldn't be surprised if it was Sir to... Highness. Right? Look at this thing. Look. Oh. Oh God. Even for the PS One, that's like fucking this. Job of the Hut. Yeah. <laughs> I am the sorceress. <laughs> Meanwhile, a meanwhile. desperate rescue begins. Why is it all painted in like stained glass? Why are you painted in stained glass? Look, I didn't ask for your artistic references. Uh, listen. Why are you named Oatmeal Johnson? Okay, that is a good story. Okay. Um, the reason why I'm named Oatmeal Johnson, as you know, you can usually see me on my like Twitter and stuff like that. The only reason why, as I used to work at a coffee shop, of course, I'm a hipster. Um, the only reason uh, I used to work at a coffee shop where uh, I kind of came home one day when I was playing TF2 and I wanted to change my name and my, uh, my boss gave me this huge box of oatmeal cookies. So my dad, so I, like, I sit down, I sit down, I'm just like, okay, so what am I going to name myself? And then I talk to my dad and I say, okay, so what am I going to name myself right now? What? I, just, I, I can't think of a good name. And my dad... No, of course my dad says it was just like your dad's prostate, and I'm just like, no, I'm, <laughs> I'm, 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 it's like of course I'm not, of, of course I'm not gonna call myself that. So, dude, and then your my dad is so cool, yeah, man. So, my dad then looks at uh, looks at the oatmeal cookies, and then looks at me, and then looks back at the oatmeal cookies, then looks back at me, and then he looks at the, and then he looks at like the clock, and then he says, and then looks at your your fucking dog. Do you have a dog? No, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> but then, and then, and then, what happens is that he just looks at me and says, "Dude, I got it. What? Oatmeal Johnson? Like, seriously, Oatmeal Johnson?" He's just like, "Yeah, Oatmeal Johnson." He's just, like, just like, "Just type it out and just see how it's gonna look." And I was like, "And then that's when you knew." And then I was like, oh my God. "This is great. <laughs> this is fantastic." This is oh so God. I kind of just use it for everything. I even use it for uh, when I design things too. I use it as a logo. <laughs> the fucking creator. Of breakfast. I am the defender of oh, breakfast. Oh, you're the defender of breakfast. Oh, look, it's Isabel. Isabel. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, so I have a, I have a story. So, yes. what is what is, what is is Spyro doing right now? Um. The, uh, no, it's not fucking rocket science. I'm not trying to trick you. What's blow, he? He's blowing fire. Okay. Well, he's breathing fire. Breathing fire okay. through his nose. So, yesterday... I decided, me and a bunch of friends decided to go to a Cluck U Chicken. Alright, <laughs> which is like down the street from the game university. Right. And fucking, they have the 911 Hot Wings Challenge. To look left or right, oh god, no. <laughs> <laughs> now, I don't even know that. I don't even need to know where this is going. <laughs> now, I'm Puerto Rican, okay? 
We eat spicy food like a mother. Yes. Okay. Oh, wait, there's a rainbow. There's a rainbow. So, we go to this place, and they're like, oh. So, you're the one in charge. Try... I don't give a fuck what you have to say. Yeah, just uh, basically, it's colors. You're, you're the one that fucking is trying to save the eggs. Don't save the eggs, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> so, we go to this place, and I'm like, all right, I'm going to try the challenge. I'm pretty sure I can beat it. The challenge is you have to eat 10 of basically the hottest wings in New Jersey in under five minutes. Okay. That just sounds like immediate intestinal distress. It gets better. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> so. Foreshadowing. So, like, we're, we're all like, we're like, you sure you want to do this? I'm like, hell yeah, I want to do this. This sounds like a good idea. Okay. Boy, was I sadly mistaken. <laughs> Because the wings come out. The wings are beautiful, by the way. I've never seen wings so good. Mm. All right. They were dark red. The sauce looked so, like, smooth and creamy. It was glistening. It was glistening. Like, the, it was calling out. That, like, have you ever fucking seen that show? It was, like, Sanjay and Craig or some shit. <laughs> and, like, fucking, they were trying to get wings. And they were like, oh, you can take the ones in the trash. And the wings were like, look at if you sound vanilla. <laughs> Okay. It was like that, except it didn't say salmonella. It was like, oh, we'll fucking make your taste buds rock. Okay. So I look at that shit. I'm like, wow, this is going to be a great experience. I take the first bite into that wing, and I was like, you know, I think I can do this. Chow down the first wing like it was nothing. All right. All right. Come the second wing. I'm like, this is getting kind of tough. By the third wing, I was like, I've made a terrible mistake. mistake. <laughs> <laughs> My mouth was on Fire. On fire. fire. We're talking about, they give you they give you a list of all the wings that they have. Right? And they tell you how many degrees it is. The 911 sauce is 150 degrees hot. I'm sorry. I just, <laughs> buddy, it was okay. It's not done yet. I'm not done yet. Okay. <laughs> so I'm at the third wing, and I'm having trouble just swallowing it. Every bite is hotter than the next. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God. I, t- I I finished the third wing finally. I had maybe three minutes left. I take a bite into the fourth wing. It was like I had entered the depths of hell <laughs> in my mouth. Satan is crawling around just saying, Hey, buddy, how you doing today? I command this particular drop of hot sauce <laughs> to be extremely <laughs> hot. So... Now I'm freaking out. I put down the wing. I quit the challenge. I'm freaking out. I am shaking uncontrollably. Okay. They don't. They don't know what to do with me. That's how. Like I, I won't stop walking around. Take I'm like, you to the hospital. Somebody. No. Fucking that. That. They make you sign a waiver before you eat the. Oh, so they can't take you to the exactly. hospital. Exactly. They like I can't sue them either. <laughs> It's like, yo, you did it. So I'm freaking out. Like, my mouth is on fire. I'm burning. I'm going crazy. And then suddenly. The guy's like, I told you not to take the challenge. I look at him, I'm like, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Why do I feel like it's it's always Americans' duty to try to be like, <laughs> it's always Americans' duty to be like, let's see how far you can push your body to the limits. <laughs> okay, so afterwards, like, they, they buy me milk. I'm calming down. And, like, I accidentally touched my eye. Oh, no. With my finger. That started a whole other thing. I was like, God damn it. My burning. I start freaking out again. The guy looks at me. He's like, so. You got to say that's a uh, no to the challenge. No, he was like, he was like, are you going to finish those hot wings? I already lost the challenge. He was like, are you going to finish the hot wings? And I was like, fuck no, I'm not going to finish those. But you can take those hot wings and shove them up your ass. Oh, my God. That would have burned twice as much. (laughs) So. I go home, and mind you, I already, I already went to the bathroom once. <laughs> oh, I already God. went to the bathroom no, once. Okay. No, Hurt like hell. Oh, my God, It no. was the worst experience I ever had going to the bathroom. Um, even next to the Taco Bell? Thing? Even me- next to the Taco Bell. Not the Crunchwrap Supreme? No, beat it, man. The Crunchwrap Supreme is what we call that giant Yo, shit that just kind of, like, leaves out, but it comes out in the hexagon. It fucking <laughs> destroys it, man. And so, oh, no. I go home. Oh, I don't tell my parents I took this challenge, because then they'll, they'll be like, oh, you know, you're going to have to fucking deal shot. with it. It's your fucking fault. I could have told you that was going to happen. You know, the, the whole, like, oh, I, I should have told you so, but I didn't yet, but I'm going to still tell you so. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> you know, so 
I'm home and oh, I almost for... oh now I, I feel it. I feel it digesting. Oh, hey, I train. That's Coltrane. Ew. Oh, he's like a puppy. So, oh, I gotta wrap the story up because we're running out of time. Anytime. So, okay, so I'm home and I feel it digesting. I can tell you exactly where the fucking chicken is in my intestines. <laughs> oh, mind you, beforehand, before we left the chicken place, I was vomiting for a good 10 minutes. Were you? Yeah. Like, not, not like in a row for 10 minutes, but like. Like, it was that first, move out of the way. I pushed everyone aside, and I vomited. Then, I, like, I did it again. I was like, move out of my way. Pushed everyone aside, vomited. Un unstoppable force. Unstoppable force. <laughs> At one point, like, I had no energy. I got up, and I did, like, I pulled the um, uh, Aaron Hansen. I got up, and I was like, ladies and gentlemen, clear path. <laughs> <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so part two to the story next time on Kill and Gaming. Please. What's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? Is Spyro gonna breathe fire? Is he gonna shit out an egg? Um, I'm thinking uh, that you're just gonna breathe fire for the rest of the time. I'm gonna tell you that I'm breathing fire right now!